Thank you for all of you that have been subscribing and leaving all your comments. It's really made a difference for me to know what you want to hear about. And one of the commonest questions I'm getting is how to find a great dentist. So that's what I'm going to talk about today. I was in that situation because I had a patient that had moved. And so I was trying to find somewhere to refer her to. So these are some of the things that I did and what I suggested. This recommendation is so key. If you're able to speak to your neighbours, friends in that area and ask them who they go to, that's a great starting point. The next thing is to do your research. Especially if you're doing anything, you know, like cosmetic dentistry, you want to really make sure you're in great hands. So the internet is a great resource. Find out about them from their website. Call them. What are they like on the phone? You know, they're welcoming, inviting then go in and see the practice. You don't have to book an appointment. You know, they should be happy and proud of their work. So look to see before and after pictures. Make sure they're their own patients and it's not just from a, you know, a book that they've bought. And ask for testimonials. We've got loads of testimonial books here. They should have certain professional um, qualifications. For cosmetic dentists, I think that they should be members of um, two organizations, the British Academy of Cosmetic Dentistry and also the American Academy of Cosmetic Dentistry. Then you know that they've had the training and that they're being monitored. But above all, especially for women, go with your gut instinct. It's such a personal space, your mouth, so that if you feel comfortable with the person that's working there, generally, you know, it's going to work out really well and you'll make a great team.